I need to go out to the workshop and cut down some lumber so I can finish uh, rebuilding the confessor prop. Maybe we need to rehash some things from yesterday. One, that was my confessor prop I was working on yesterday. It's a pneumatic prop, and it's going to be in the next room of the haunt. They're going to go through a curtained archway into the confessional booth, and that's where the confessor prop is going to be behind the screen. Now he'll be motion activated. The prop's based on a design by Terra Syndicate. Steve Hickman put out a book, The Home Haunter's Prop Building Handbook. Shows how to build the prop. The pneumatic cylinder that I'm using, the door closer, that's from another website. Can't remember off the top of my head, but I'll link it somewhere down here. I'll mention it. That mask, that's a Terra Syndicate mask too. It's a decent pour, nice and thick, and pretty cheap for a mask like that. I think I got it for about $25. And the shirt I was distressing, the color, the purple, it kind of reminded me of like the priest's vestment colors. Okay, now that we've uh, covered what you should have heard yesterday, let's get on to what we're doing today. What I'm gonna be doing is adding a few different colors of uh, wash to the, uh, to the clothes. By the way, is a green now. It's in addition to the green, I'm gonna go with the a little bit of yellow. Okay, it's gonna get wet. set of shoulders here.
If you like what you see, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and let me know in the comments section below how you think I might be able to attach some shoulders to this. Okay, thanks for watching. Need to go out to the workshop and cut down some lumber so that I can finish building the compressor prop. The compressor prop. Give the video a thumbs up. And consider <clears throat> if, you if you like what you see, give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel.